The images just released are shocking. A woman identified as former principal Carmen Perez Dixon drags a kindergartner out of a classroom by the leg. Even though the child lays motionless on the ground and doesn't appear to fight back, the principal picks the girl up by the arm and leg before dropping the student on the floor. She then picks the girl up again and appears to grab her by the hair or hood. It actually was a little, little painful for me as a parent. But despite the disturbing video from spring 2012 going public for the first time Friday, that former principal of Tisdale School still works for the district, even though her bosses say she should be fired. The board did not exactly agree with us. Um, you know, so the action that was taken was not what we recommended. If I heard the same evidence and we saw the same video today, um, we would support the same recommendation that we made at that time. Bridgeport Public Schools Chief Administrative Officer Sandra Case says the recommendation was to fire the principal who is shown in a second video dragging another kindergartner. Dixon was suspended for six months without pay, but instead of losing her job, the Board of Ed is giving her another one, this time as an administrator. You're not supposed to put your hand on somebody else's child. Dixon's attorney says her client's actions were within the Board of Ed policy to use reasonable force and points out the board issued a written decision stating Dixon's actions did not rise to the level of termination. Now, according to Dixon's attorney, those videos were supposed to be confidential. They were released to local news stations by the parents of the kindergartners in the video. But Dixon's attorney says she's now calling for an investigation into how they were made public. In Bridgeport, Checky Beckford, News 4 New York.